tuelewe mm-hmm. kitu kimoja rais anawashauri wengi mno kwenye maswali mm-hmm. ya sheria rais anamshauri DPP mwendeshaji mm-hmm. wa mashtaka anamshauri solicitor general mm-hmm. anamshauri attorney general mwanasheria mkuu Mm-hmm. anawashauri ni ofisi yake anawashauri wa, wa sheria pale wanamsaidia na sheria mm-hmm. kwa hivyo hana upungufu wa washauri na sisi mm-hmm. wananchi tunampa mm-hmm. rais uwezo wa kuajiri washauri wa sheria wengi anataka mwenye mm-hmm. okay mm-hmm. so okay. hiyo tuelewe kitu cha kwanza kitu cha pili mm-hmm. kama rais anapotoshwa mm-hmm. na washauri wake mhm ni wajibu wa rais ukipotoa mm-hmm. washauri wako utaweza kumwamini tena kukushauri mara ya pili huwezi mm-hmm. kwa hivyo utamuomba mm-hmm. resignation yake kusabuka kupotosha rais anataka awe na washauri walokuwa anawaamini na wanaweza mm-hmm. kumpa ushauri wa sheria uliokuwa wa maana sasa kama washauri wanakupotosha na mm-hmm. sote tumekaa tunasema rais anapotoshwa na washauri okay ndio ndio clearly ye yeah, haoni kama washauri wamempotosha maana ingekuwa anaona washauri wamempotosha <laughs> Eh hey, anawafukuza wasi. Anawafukuza kwa staha anawaomba uh-huh. resignation yao. Uh-huh. Kama hutaki kufukuza mtu. Ya mimi nisingependa uh-huh. kufukuza mtu ningemwita mshauri wangu kama Tony Jeno nikamwambia sikiliza Tony Jeno mimi nitaki kufukuza uh-huh. lakini ningeomba ningeomba uh-huh. resignation yako eh uh-huh. nipe resignation yako ili nisionekane kama nimekufukuza. Right? Mm-hmm. Ana nipa resignation mm-hmm. na announce kwamba resignation kanipa resignation yake na nimefurahi kuipokea. Mm-hmm. Sio <laughs> kwamba mm-hmm. nime nimehuzunika, nime nimefurahi. Ndio. Kuna kuna lugha. Eh. Kaisa kusema kuipokea. Nina furaha kuipokea <laughs> ina maana kwamba kila mtu anaosikia anaelewa kwamba oh, hii ni forced resignation. Lakini rais akisema ninahuzunika kuipokea ndio na maana kwamba sio force resignation yule bwana alitaka mambo mengine umeelewa kuna lugha fulani za ki za ki political language which Ndiyo. in civilized societies mm-hmm. watu wanaelewa maana yake eh ndio wanaelewa kwamba bwana na... huyu eh huyu katimuliwa uh-huh. lakini hatusemi hivyo lakini katimuliwa umeelewa this is sophistication Ndiyo kuna sophistication mm-hmm. language and kwenye kwa hivyo kuna ile kustaafu kuna ile zamani walikuwa natumia wazee walikuwa nasema kastaafu kwa manufaa ya umma eh eh kastaafu kwa manufaa ya umma kwa hivyo mtu hey. una 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 mpastara una mpastara lakini lakini society nzima inaelewa jamii mm. inaelewa kumetokea nini so Sao. kwa nini tunasema kwamba kapotoshwa Ye yeah, mwenye haoni mm-hmm. kama kapotoshwa. Eh, anaona sawa tu. Anaona sawa, mimi tu sielewi. Unajua mimi inajikera watu wanatea maneno kwenye mdomo wa rais. Mm. Look at her actions. Mhm. Hajapotoshwa. Mm-hmm. Yeye hajapotoshwa ana yeye anao. Yeah, na o... ah, whatever, hajapotoshwa. Kwa sababu mm. rais alopotoshwa anachukua action. Mm-hmm. Ana he's betrayed. Yeah. You will feel betrayed mm-hmm. especially Ndiyo. Maria kama mm-hmm. unaamini kwamba mm-hmm. umepotoshwa umemchukua member of the opposition umemtia mm-hmm. ndani kinyume mm-hmm. na sheria umesikia mm-hmm. Ume, umepewa Ndiyo. advice kwamba huyu mm-hmm. mtu it's not na tunajua kwamba rais kaamua maamuzi ya kumweka ndani mbowe yamepata go ahead ya rais Why do we know that? Kwa sababu mm-hmm. kwenye 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 uh, interview yake na BBC mm-hmm. right? Ndio. Ali defend hayo maamuzi. 
akasema akatuambia kwamba mnaona alikuwa anasafiri anakwenda anasafiri anatoka nchini anarudi anakimbia anakwenda uh, Mwanza uh, anakwenda no anakwenda nani Kenya yeah. akirudi if you remember anakwenda Kenya Ndiyo. akirudi kwa hivyo huyu mtu lazima kufanya ugaidi eh? alikuwa mm-hmm. anakimbia i mean so you can see she was defending that decision and the mm-hmm. decision the decision um, the roots of the decision were from her mm-hmm. now she she felt a need to defend it yes um, so the issue the issue then is for sure mimi na uh, it's clear to me ukitazama yale mazingira kwamba alikuwa anaelewa what was going on na mm-hmm. maamuzi katoka kwake nimetoka kwake sasa ubakia uh, mm. kusema kwamba kumsingizia sijui washauri wake so on and so forth tunamsingizia basi washauri wote wamemwa maneno hayo hayo ina maana DPP kamwambia mkamate mboe IGP kamwambia mm-hmm. mkamate mboe Diwani wa Tis kamwambia mkamate mboe eh, nani Attorney General kamwambia mkamate mboe advisors wake kwa sababu rais hana own legal person. advisors eh ana personal advisors also personal legal advisors wamemwambia mkamate mm-hmm. mboe alafu kuna political advisors mm-hmm. <laughs> wamemwambia wamemwambia mkamate mboe um, umeelewa eh ndio hivi ame exhaust ushauri wote au kaamua tu maana ndio kama hivyo wasema wote we are assuming eh. wote ili eh. ili this mm-hmm. narrative kwamba kapotoshwa na wa advisor wake wa advisors wake iwe na ukweli wa wote ina maana kwamba advisors wake wote wamemu advise um kamate boy this cannot mm. be possible in my view hata kama mm. kwenye advisors wake wote hao kulikuwa na wawili walimwambia walimwambia mm-hmm. usimkamate mboe kwa sababu ya a b c mm-hmm. ina maana wakati anaamua anaamuru mm-hmm. endeleeni mm-hmm. kumkamata kwa sababu huwezi kumkamata member chairman of the head of the opposition of the biggest mm. opposition, opposition party Tanzania bara bila ya rais mm-hmm. kuelezwa ku, ku, umeelewa na kuomba idhini as such alikuamua kwamba natoa idhini yangu endeleeni right ndio mm-hmm. in order for her mm-hmm. to be mm-hmm. completely hata hapo lazima alikuwa na agency ndio what advisors wake wamemwambia kwamba mkamate lakini let's assume advisors wake wawili wamemwambia usimkamate na sita mm-hmm. wamemwambia mkamate mtie ndani mm-hmm. mm-hmm. still she made a decision mhm kafanya maamuzi decision kafanya maamuzi mm-hmm. advice ushauri unapewa to my friend mm-hmm. mwisho wewe the bank mm-hmm. stopped with the president mm-hmm. ushauri wali ni washauri tu ndio decision maamuzi yanatoka kwa rais hata kama advisors wako wote wanakwambia mkamate mm-hmm. still that is only advice ule ni ushauri tu maria mm-hmm. ndio mwisho amri mm-hmm. na maamuzi yanatoka kwa rais the bank stops with the president Mhm. Asante sana. Alikuwa rais gani yule wa Marekani mm-hmm. alisema the buck stops here. Ah, uh, uh, not I think it was I think it was Eisenhower actually. You think it was Eisenhower? Yes, Eisenhower. Yes. To, yes, the buck stops here. A, yeah. a plaque yes. on his on his yes. uh, desk. Yes. Alikuwa anasema the buck stops here. Kujikumbusha kila siku kwamba mwisho makuli nasimama hapo kila kile kitu mzunguko na simamia anything that happens he mm. is accountable for and he is responsible for hawezi kumrushia mtu mwingine alawama asante sana shangazi tuta-